Malaika and I Aisha. Today we are here at SMK Raja Puan Muda Tengku Fauzia for the National English DB Competition 2024. Prolix is the host for this year's exciting debate competition. So we have students from various secondary schools from all over Malaysia come down here to show off their adaptive skill and compete in this competition. Yes, that's true. We are happy to welcome all of you. Here are some clips of the debates. Look how confident and smart these students are. They made great arguments and used strong points to support their ideas. And guess what? We also had a chance to talk to some of the participants. Yeah, let's hear what they had to say about the competition. How do you feel about your team performance overall? Uh, I think my team's performance overall could be improved. However, we think we did our best in a given situation. What have you learned from today's experience that you will use in future debates? I think what I learned from today is sticking to the fact that we need to justify our examples and actually provide the examples in the first place and be more careful about incentive analysis. How did your team prepare for today's competition? Uh, our team prepared for the prepared motion. We did uh, a lot of research about the topic and then for the impromptu motion, we, um, we team up and then we think about like, what was it? Uh? We, yeah, possible. Yeah. First, we identify the problem, and then we find the solution. Yeah, and then we build out the cases from there, lah. Yeah, that's how we do impromptu. Hey, guys, you guys. Yep, sure. There a moment in the debate that surprised you? Um, well, of course, there was a moment, but uh, I think um, one of the moment that really surprised me and captured like my attention during the debate was like one of the speaker uh, said something about murder. I was I really surprised me and I think it really captured the moment of uh, and the heat of the debate since everyone was talking about it. So that would be my uh, favorite moment and uh, moment that really shocked me. How did you handle the pressure of adapting in front of judges and on audience? I think that pressure is a natural part of debating and honestly, to be very frank, the pressure doesn't really get to me because I have experience in debating for quite a long time and overall I think it's actually quite fun when there's pressure because then the pressure kind of gives you the incentive to do better. What so strategy did your team use to approach today's debate? To pick? So I think the main thing that we did in today's debate is just trying to allocate our roles properly. So he's our first speaker and we mainly just let him do all the setup and stuff. I helped with uh, argumentation and our second speaker is over there. Uh, as for in the round itself, um, our approach, I would say, for myself was trying to just weigh out a lot of things and just say why certain things were more important than other things. But yeah. Hi, uh, my name is Ravindran Sarindran. I'm the first speaker from SMK Kota Kemaling, Shah Alam, Selangor. What do you think your team did really well in today's debate? Well, honestly, we did a couple things really well, but ultimately I feel like we were certified whistlers. We were able to convince the judges and woo them. Of course, uh, I think we made some mistakes here and there and uh, we're going to be going away the first round but uh, I think we did a good job. We got a lot of good feedback and definitely tomorrow we're coming back much stronger. That's all for me. Thank you for taking the time. Wow, they all did such a great job. It sounds like they really enjoyed the competition. In the end, we had some amazing winners. We hope you enjoy our coverage of day one of the National English Debate Competition 2024. It's just so much fun to watch and share it with all of you. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe our channel for more updates. And hit the bell icon so you never miss a new video. Bye for now, see you next time.